In this video, we will learn more about harvesting users. Let's see how this section works. So the first option in harvesting users is add from user. Basically, this means adding a user from a YouTube URL, a channel URL. So here's how you do it. Click on add from user, then put in the channel URL of the user that you want to add. So it will be something like this. Now you got to select the group that you want to add the user to. So you got, I've got two groups over here, which I added earlier, but you can always add a new group and a group is like a, it's like a segmentation. It's the place where you logically divide the channels that you add. So if you'd be dealing with multiple niches, each niche stands for one group. So this is a music channel. So I'm going to just call it music or whatever you want. You can call whatever you want and click submit. This person is added, saved successfully. And if you click on harvested users, you can see that inside the music group, there's one person that we added here. Click on get users and you will see this person over here. Back to harvest videos, harvest users, sorry. Next we have find from keywords. Click on that and put in a keyword that you want to work with. So let's call it, let's put in a keyword. Let's put in jazz music and put in how many channels you want to harvest. So let's go with hundred, select the group. So it was music again and click submit. You'll notice that the number of pending tasks increased. It went from zero to one and everything that you do on YouTube traffic that can that is related to getting some data from YouTube it's saved as a task and tasks are run in the background when you're ready and they will continue and tube traffic will get the data from YouTube and add it to the software without you having to do anything manually so when you're ready just click on the play button and the task will start running the status bar will show you which task is running so here it says get users keyword jazz music <coughs> And all the tasks that you create will be queued in a line and this task is uh, being processed right now it might take a few seconds and depending on how much gap you have between two subsequent tasks it will be processed according to that time gap meanwhile let's continue next we have harvest youtube pages and it's quite simple click on harvest youtube pages and put in the url of any youtube page it could be a search result it could be uh, any kind of page where youtube urls are listed uh, from on youtube.com of course and put in that url let me show you an example so i have this page on youtube i can take the url from here put it on over here select the group again click submit and again a task will be created and all the youtube urls all the youtube channels on that youtube page will be harvested next you can harvest from the youtube top feeds these are the kind of feeds that we have available on youtube and you can target the number of uh, channels you want to harvest select the group again click submit and a task for that will be created finally you can see a list of all the channels that you've harvested so for music we've been able to harvest 63 channels and here's a list of all the channels if you want you can save it to a file so this is like your ready decorated list you know because before we start commenting anywhere we need to have a list of the relevant channels and this is how you prepare that this is how you do it collect the list from different sources there are different ways you can add it manually you can get it from keywords you can get it from any url you can get it from the top feed and finally you can see a list of harvested users this is how harvested harvest users